Hi, this is Hope for Peace, reporting to you from beautiful and sunny Santa Cruz, California. Thank you for time, taking your time out with me today to review this material, which I think is highly important to our political situation right now in America. I'm putting together this playlist for all of us who do not normally watch this type of media, and particularly for people who think that this media is not having any impact um, on our current political atmosphere. In the media war, which was President Obama's first 100 days, Fox News and right-wing commentators won hands down. In three months of programming, they turned conservatives into protesters in the massive Fox GOP-backed tea parties on this last tax day. My favorite sign from tea parties was the American taxpayer Jews for Obama's ovens. There were also many posters of Obama with Hitler mustaches, um, etc. So I do encourage you to go out online and, and examine what that protest was really all about. I don't say what I'm saying here lightly. I realize I'm making a strong statement against a powerful segment of our culture, and I hope to be very careful with my words. I'm not trying to personally attack anyone, but I must point out that the majority of what Fox News commentators say is fact is actually not fact at all. In these shows, news is stirred in with and often replaced by the talking points of the conservative movement. This is the fact. Fair and balanced, no spin zone, which Fox touts, you will see is blatant false advertising. Also, I'm working on a documentary on the subject and I lost my most excellent partner due to illness. God bless, Ricky. Healing vibes. This project is dedicated to you. When this playlist is over, you will see why I cannot do this alone. So anyone who would like to join me and participate, especially someone with a Mac, um, please email me. The name of this movie is Rupert Murdoch Rules the World. And it's also dedicated to John, who came up with the name, and to Aaron, my two wonderful sons. A few things to keep in mind as you watch. Uh, Bill O'Reilly has had the top-rated cable news show in primetime and Fox News in general, and Fox ge uh, generally dominates the cable news ratings, often twice the audience of the closest competitor. What you are about to see sells, and sells big. Beck and Hannity which follow O'Reilly in the lineup, uh, are new in 2009. Hannity used to be Hannity and Combs. He dropped Combs in January and is now by himself. Um, it's just a Hannity show, and Glenn Beck used to be on the radio, and he now has the Glenn Beck show. Um, this is new just since January of this year. They also follow up this lineup, um, which is O'Reilly, Hannity, and Beck. After that, you get the red eye. Um, a show that is uh, the most offensive, in my opinion. After working full-time on research for this past year, it is my belief that we are just off eight years of conservative policy, which led to disastrous consequences for the U.S. Those facts are now covered up by blaming Obama for 90% of our current massive problems, even though he's only been in office for now less than four months. It seems that Fox spends 99.9% .9 of their time o decrying Obama and 0.01 covering Bush's contributions to our current problem. These are deep subjects, which I will cover in Rupert Murdoch and seven more films around similar subjects. If you would like to participate with me, please feel free to contact me. I would really appreciate it. I realize this stuff is hard to watch if you're not used to it. Try and suffer through the whole thing. If you get emotional fatigue, watch at least the first one minute of each clip. You owe it to your country. Watch at least the first one minute of each clip. And then if you want to skip forward, I, I completely understand. Um, I'm going to add in some commentation. Um, I want you to understand I'm just a mom. I'm not a, I'm not a TV news show. I, I, I have no training in this. I just have been studying the subject um, for many years. And um, when I come with the understanding of the news that I have, which I think is well researched and based in fact, and I watch new, uh, Fox News, it's absolutely distressing because so very little of what they say is actually based in reality. It's very dangerous. 
The first video that you're going to see in the playlist is a non-Fox video. I want to tell you that right up front. But it does show the results of this continued bashing. Good luck. Be sure and catch the wrap-up at the end. There's another playlist on here that has about 45 of uh, these type of videos if you'd like to keep watching. And again, I really appreciate your time. Thank you so much and blessings.